finally got my PS5. Oh yeah. What the? Damn you, Singala! Damn you! Damn you! Damn you! Damn you! The Colonel will not only steal your girl, but also your PS5. <laughs> Honestly, don't let the Colonel steal your PlayStation 5 because it's hard to get the console out there. Now, the new PlayStation 5 is one of the most sought after consoles ever. And Sony has shown over the years that the PlayStation brand is something that is strong and people want. Starting with the PlayStation 1 when they came to face of Nintendo, the PS2, the PS3, the PlayStation 4 which came out and basically turned the tide against Microsoft, and of course the PlayStation 4 Pro, and now the PlayStation 5. Now, with the console, there are many features that I can talk about, but it all revolves around games. And we'll get to the games in a second, but let's start off from one of the first things you see when you turn on the console, which makes you want to get the PlayStation 5, the UI. The UI approach is very simplistic and very reminiscent of PlayStation's idea of giving games to the gamer. And that's the first thing you encounter. You get into the UI, you can see all the games you wanna play right there. There's a games in media. You can switch over to media to watch content like Hulu, Netflix, and all that stuff, which is fine, which is great, but gamers want a game, and that's the first thing you see. All the games you own are right there on the top. You can actually go into each game. You can see all the extra features that are built into the game, achievements, all that fun stuff. You can get more games, and that allows the gamer to jump in and play as soon as possible. It is very important because this is a gaming console. I mean, if you want the PlayStation 5, then you want to play games. And that's the thing that Sony drives right ahead into this console. Now, the next thing that I think a lot of people appreciate is the controller. The new DualSense 5 controller is a wonderful revamp to what PlayStation has done. Now, I personally am not a fan of the dual thumbsticks next to each other. It's just something I've just never gotten used to. But I really love the improvements to this controller. Uh, just the spacing of the controller, the width, the D-pad, which is something Sony does so well. So you're playing games like Street Fighter, it works really well. That touchpad on top, adding extra functionality and the haptic feedback is amazing. Plus those pressure sensitive triggers when you're playing uh, you know, games like Call of Duty, you get to feel that quite properly. Now, little features on the controller like having a microphone and speaker built into it is great because you get little cues. Uh, while I was recording uh, this gameplay session uh, for the video, just having little cues come out of the controller for different scenes in the game is nice. I think a lot of gamers love what Sony has put into it and taking the controller to the very next level and I think it definitely shows while you're gaming. But honestly, don't take it from me, take it from the Colonel himself. Uh. Mm -hmm. Move, move, move. Ah, <laughs> hey, yes, yes, yes. So you people are wondering why me too, I love the PlayStation 5. Well, it's very simple. You know, I use this for military practice. So when I'm going for special hubs mission, you know, I use it. It allows me to do, you know, digital invasion. I don't like to shoot people anymore in real life. But also, this reminds me of the last time when I went to get my seventh wife. I had a special house mission like this. I jumped inside with my parachute. It was fantastic and she was so happy to see me. So, you know, PlayStation 5 you know, is great for getting your wives. So as you can see, the Colonel loves playing games. I, I don't justify his reasoning there, but this is where the PlayStation takes full root. The games you can play. The backlog and the back catalog of, of games that PlayStation has is immense. And this is what gamers have talked about. I remember my Xbox Series S video, a lot of people were like, look, PlayStation has games, man. There are a lot of games you can play. And that is very true. From titles like Spider-Man Miles Morales, which are built for the PlayStation 5, really showcases how great the console is. The ability to switch from performance RT to performance to better frame rates, which you can do with almost every single game on the console, is truly amazing. But there's just so many games to play, for, play from. Even going back to games like Ghost of Tsushima, which I just started playing on the PlayStation 5, is amazing, looks good, 
really great. You've got access catalog for, for things like God of War. You still play, of course, Call of Duty. Uh, you can play things like Second Son, which leads me to another feature that the PlayStation, PlayStation 5 has, is the ability to have PlayStation Plus and PlayStation Now. Those are two key elements that add more to the gaming experience. And as you've noticed in this video, I've talked about games, 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 and games. Now with PlayStation Plus and PlayStation Now, uh, you've got two services that give you two very distinct things. Now with uh, PlayStation Now, I can go ahead and stream games to my console. So games like Second Son, I'm streaming directly to my console, which is great. I don't have to download it and I have to take full advantage. Uh, I can still take full advantage of the console. While with games from PlayStation Plus, I get a, a free game every, every month. Also playing a game like Last of Us, which I have not played the original version of the game, is something I can jump into and play. Now that's a really great experience for any gamer who's looking for games to play. PlayStation has that and the console can perform. Like I haven't even spent time talking about performance of the console. We know it is well matched. It can do all the things it's supposed to do. I am giving you those high frame rates, you know, 4K 60, 4K 120, depending on the television you're using and running with. You've also got that built-in Blu-ray player in there so you can actually watch content on Blu-ray. And it's got a ton of features that make it just a really robust gaming experience. Okay, so it's not all hunky-dory on the PlayStation 5. I have had issues with this console, which is why I made the other video about the Xbox Series S and the PlayStation 5. But I've had shutdowns and slowdowns, which have improved, by the way, with updates. The one thing that still stays is the fact that my network keeps disconnecting for whatever reason. And I know my buddy Warren Bowman has videos on that. So definitely check out his channel to see what he, he's talking about in fixing some of the issues with the PlayStation 5. Storage options, again, it comes with one terabyte, sorry, 875, actually down to 600. Uh, I just downloaded uh, Final Fantasy and I had no space on my console. So the ability to have more storage space is something I like to see. Yes, I can use external storage, but I want to be able to use those fast speeds and we've heard this summer we can add in a second SSD, most likely a Samsung SSD into there to capture the speeds there. If you want a PlayStation 5, the reasons are right here. One more reason I even forgot to mention is 3D audio. This is the ability to give you that nice immersive sound experience when using headphones in the PlayStation 5. If you're not using a sound bar or a speaker like me, I, it's so immersive, it is a great experience. I think overall gamers will like what the PlayStation 5 holds, not just for now, but for the whole life cycle of the console. And this puts gamers almost in par with PC gamers. Isn't that right, Daniel? He's a PC master race guy. But anyway, you get the idea there. The PS5 has the games, has the performance, and has all you need for you to want a PlayStation 5. So if you have any questions, any comments, guys, let me know. Leave your thoughts down below about what you think about the PlayStation 5. Do you want one? Do you agree with me? Or do you agree with the Colonel and his own little ideas of why he's playing the PlayStation 5 or he stole Saf's PlayStation? Otherwise, thank you very much. And don't forget to like, share, and enjoy your entertainment.